then about the ligature mark how we study it so the most important study is about the ligature and we look for because this imprints it is called as imprint abrasion a deep groove and this is initially it is pale but later on it becomes dark hard and parchment like so it's an groove depressed groove going backward and upward at the occipital region and looks pale early and later on it becomes brownish parchment or leathery like hardened then abrasion and bruises can be seen because of the suspension the ligature will slip because of suspension the ligature will slip during the fall and the abrasion and bruises around the ligature will be seen around the groove and this is because of the upward motion of the ligature because of suspension this so you can see how deep groove is the material being used is important if it is a rope it is a wire it will produce a deep imprint and if it is a soft material broader piece of cloth dupatta sari or any chadar type it will produce a broad and faint mark but the hard material the rope the wire will produce a deep imprint then regarding the placement where the ligature it is usually above the thyroid cartilage completely encircling the neck and spade area is where there is a lift up so from the front and side it will be going back and lift up at the lift up area there will be no mark of imprint and it is usually present on the front and the sides so in complete hanging the mark is situated above the level of the thyroid cartilage between the larynx and the chin it is directed obliquely backward and upward and along the line of the mandible toward the occipital region and where there is lift up and in those region this is the lift up because of the weight and the knot and this is the spade area you can see the imprint on the sides sometimes the fiber material it is on the embedded in the skin and in 80% cases it is above the thyroid cartilage and in 15 at the level and in 5% it is below the thyroid cartilage now regarding the character of the ligature material it depends upon the nature of a ligature the body weight and the time of suspension and the number of turns if the number of turns are more than one each turn will produce its imprint and moreover there will be pinching of the skin between the turns the skin will be pinched in between the turns so the nature of material means if it is hard material like rope and wire it will produce deep imprint and soft material like cloth will not produce any deep mark weight of the body the heavier body will produce a deep furrow and smaller weight body will not be as uh, deep furrow making then degree of suspension the more the time is suspended more deep will be the groove and the number of turns if it is more than one they will make their own imprint and then there will be pinching of the skin so you can see the material the rope and the wire and it will produce a well defined and deep groove but when soft material like cloth it is not as well defined so longer the time the body will be suspended it will be well defined so this is also important that if the turns are more than one the skin will be pinched between the turns the ligature and the tie they should be preserved we should note it down in which course it is adopting and we will cut it preserve it label it right and left and the knot 
because this is the knot which is to be produced in the court of law and they will reconstruct so you will preserve the ligature then the this ligature and the knot they are of two types either it may be fixed knot or it may be running knot the fixed knot may be reef or uh, granny whatever it is but the running is between the loop when the rope is passed between the loop this is fixed granny or roof whatever but the it is fixed together and this is the loop either the whole rope is passed through the loop or one end is made loop and single rope is passing through this is loop and in this with the suspension time with the weight it will cons be constricting more so in case of running knot the weight of the body will cause the noose to tighten mainly in the usually in the horizontal position it doesn't slip because it immediately tightens up and keeps on tightening by the weight of the body and it may be slip knot or it may be at the noose loop so we should examine we should cut and preserve it label right and left and it should be preserved for the court it is to be presented in the court of law thank you very much